Welcome once again to Smash Brothers Ultimate, and we are going to be playing as Ryu uh, from the Street Fighter series today. I'm not sure how well I'm going to do. I like to play as Ryu, but uh, I don't always think that... Uh, I'm typically, like, amazing with Ryu, but we're gonna, we're gonna try. Alright, here we go. Now, right off the bat, my opponent is gonna be playing very cheeky. So, I, I have to be a little careful here. I've really gotta pay attention to... A lot of the distance attacks that uh, this player is using. Right now, it's very difficult. I can't seem to catch a break. Oh no. I see. I see the direction of this battle already, unfortunately. Very effective maneuvers, though, I must say. I haven't really fought against uh, this character that much. I think this is either uh, Pyra or Mithra. Um, Mithra, I think. Um, from the uh, Xenoblade series. I, Yeah. You can tell I haven't played um, that type of game. It's like one of those... Um, JRPGs, I think. I'm not really into those a whole lot. Um, as far as RPGs go, the one that I've played most consistently is Pokemon. But I'm sure Pokemon is a lot different than the uh, Xenoblade series. And also, if, uh, if I'm wrong, uh, feel free to correct me. Like I said, I'm not very familiar. Anyway, um, I'm just trying to hold my own here. This is a very tough battle. So, let's see what I can do. Okay, now, um, the other character just transformed into a different, uh, main character. Again, um, I'm assuming that's Pyra. So, I just, I've gotta play my cards right here. Yeah, I think this is definitely Pyra because of the fire attacks and, um, the word Pyro. It's, it's, it's too similar to be a coincidence, right? So, let's see what Ryu is capable of. Now you'll notice that my opponent, Sean, um, attacks me when I'm off the ledge. And uh, it's actually um, very, a very good maneuver. And, I mean, let's be honest. When you're playing a game like this, um, it's really what you're supposed to do. You'll notice that I didn't really do the same. And there's a good reason for that. It's mostly because... Um, Knowing how my opponent was playing, I I didn't want to take the risk. Um, so I guess we'll go with a brand new opponent. Anyway, Ryu is a pretty versatile character. I mean, um, he has a good special, which is his... Uh, uh, I forget what that move is called, to be honest. Um... And I can't actually hear any audio until after I record, which, um, in hindsight, m might not be <laughs> a great idea. Um, oh, the Hadouken, yeah. Um, so, I'm kind of a noob when it comes to recording from the Switch. Um... My TV currently has no sound, and that's because I don't want my mic to pick up any sound from the TV. So, 
that's why right now I can't hear anything. Um, I'm sure there's a better way, honestly. But, uh, this is fine for right now. I don't, you know, I don't need to have sound to, uh, play the game. So, this is fine. Now look at this move. Pretty interesting. Holy cow. What a strong character. Or should I say characters? I'm guessing that's her uh, recovery. So, I'm gonna have to fight just as hard if I wanna even come close to winning. Every time a new character is released, it's like, uh, it's like learning the game again. Or at least learning that character again. I have to understand, um, what, what her weaknesses would be. I don't know, this is not the same opponent as last time, it's just the same character. I pretty much just rolled right into that. Now, this person is, uh, playing a lot better than the last one. Definitely. So, I gotta figure out what I can, what I can do to get a victory here. That was a strong attack, but I missed it. There we go. That's, that's what Ryu can do. He can, he can basically counter the attack. Ooh, that was nice. That was nice. I don't think there's a good chance of me winning this one, though. I might be able to take a stock, but that might be about it, unfortunately. Very good attacks. So, I think I will go ahead and do one more battle with Ryu. And I was correct. Her name is, in fact, Pyra. Okay. Good to know. I mean, there's only 80 characters. I should be able to memorize them at this point, right? Anyway, GG's to my friend Cosmic. Well, not my friend. I don't I don't know you, but GG's. We'll go ahead for a rematch. You know, this game is easy to pick up and play, but the learning curve to be, like, master level uh, takes a lot of training. You know, like, Cosmic here has played, I mean, this, this Cosmic person has mastered these characters, and you can tell right away. I couldn't really even do much other than uh, give Cosmic about 10% damage in that one stock. The moves are just so fast, it's hard to keep up. I can grab a few times if I need to, but that recovery is slick. And I gotta. I'm trying to understand the moveset here, too, because it's definitely unique. She can apparently throw her sword. And she predicted that I would roll to the other side, which is really good. Mm, this is a really tough matchup. I'm not gonna lie. She pretty much has all the grounds covered. Um, a lot of my defenses aren't even working, so, I mean, I need to, uh, study this character more, I think. Because some of those attacks have this unreal range to them. I could try something risky. No, I'm not. I'll just let her fall down. Okay. See, there's a lot of swords, and 
I don't really do well against the swords, truth be told. You have to really study the other person and how they're deciding to play to understand their weaknesses. And, um, you know, sometimes it actually pays off to be patient and to wait to understand what your opponent is doing. But I think for right now, I am going to have to uh, take a break. So thank you to everyone who was watching, and I will see you in the next Smash Brothers video.